All right, everybody, real quick video today. This applies to those of you, especially with a 10th gen Honda Civic or a 2017 up CRV, especially the LX model. So on 2016, 17, and 18 Civics, and then the 17, 18, and 19, I believe, CRV, if you get an LX model without any of the lane keep assist, you know, enhanced features, um, you can buy this mirror that I got here. This is the OEM mirror out of a 2014 Toyota Camry. And I got it for around $75. It's used, but it looks brand new. Um, just make sure you get the wiring harness with it. But you'll see on the back of the mirror, there's a plug that plugs in. And it even came with this little uh, wire cover right here, which is optional. But what's key about this mirror is it does fit the standard Civic CRV uh, wedge mount, just like the factory mirror does. So you can just undo that little torque screw, pop the factory mirror off, put this one on, tighten it up. And then you want to connect, there's just a power and a ground. You want to connect it to an ignition source. So easy way to do it is just to run a wire, you know, a power and a ground across the headliner and you can just tuck it down behind the pillar there by pulling out the uh, the rubber trim along the edge, feed it down. And then you can either use your cigarette lighter uh, feed down here, or you can tie into the switched feed for the radio. In my case, I have an aftermarket stereo. So that's what I did. But that way the key just works with the ignition. But why I picked the one for a Camry is because it has the white lettering to match the obviously gauges on our honda they have all the white lettering so it automatically dims at night uh it's an auto dimming mirror which you can turn on and off you can set your compass region it's just a gentex mirror like all the others but the white is what makes it unique it makes it a good fit for a honda so kind of a universal thing but just a nice upgrade. Now I have a compass. Obviously our temperature is on here. Compass is on here. All right, so just a quick little video. Hopefully it helps you out. If you have any questions, leave a comment below. Until next time, we'll see you later.